Hey guys, welcome. I just wanted to take you through a little demonstration of the site that's been uh, built so far. Here's the home page. At the top here, we'll have a different banner for the different promotion we're offering, whether it's encouraging um, new users or whatever. Come down here and you can choose different sports and browse the odds for the different sports. As you see from the home page, you'll be able to see the um, bookmaker odds here and all the different odds available. Also the peer-to-peer -peer side, the different odds, so you'll easily be able to compare between the two. And you'll be able to come in and view all bets, but from here, you'd need to be registered to do that. So let's, uh, up the top, you'd log in, all functioning, working well. Let's uh, register here. The usernames needs to be um, uh, unique, but don't uh, disclose any of your own personal information as you don't want to, um, other people to necessarily know who you are in real life. So use a alias on the platform and we use this so people in the peer-to-peer -peer side will be able to, um, we're going to be mad punter, one, two, three, just as an example. And again, I wouldn't use it, this actual email address I'm using is um, the same name. I wouldn't recommend using the same email address. So just don't use something that people can identify you with. Enter a password. Come in for a date of birth. Obviously, everyone needs to be over 18. How old will we be this time? This is not my real date of birth, unfortunately. To be over 18, agree to the terms and conditions. You come in and register. Now you can either verify via phone number or email address. We're going to verify by email address. We'll come over to the email, get the OTP. All right, now we're in. One thing we notice a lot of room for improvement in the existing betting platforms is the collection of data. So from the very beginning, we come in here and you can select which sports uh, you're interested in so then we can obviously target um, things for that specific user so we'll come in here we'll do cricket american football some horse racing and uh, table tennis you can obviously skip that step if you want so here's the user dashboard very simple call to action at the top I want you to initially log in verify your account this will be connected with on feeder i won't run through that process um, but it's all working working well top up your wallet and add funds here you would come in here in the sports book. So we started to pull odds from and events from BetRadar, but the full betting flow isn't working yet, but in the next week or two it will be. So you would come in here as if you wanted to take uh, Brentford, you would enter the amount, the, the screen pops up here, make it very easy, you enter the amount of bet you want to take on that and place your bet, simple as that. Uh, for the peer-to-peer -peer side, come in here again, you see the odds that are offered for each particular game. Again, you could come in and take, accept that bet if you wanted to, create a betting slip, or you can come in here and view all the bets in the marketplace. So you'll see the different users. And again, so this is where I mentioned before, your username will actually be shown on the peer-to-peer -peer side if you um, make a bet. You can also um, send the bets, you will be able to, not the initial version, but you'll be able to send direct bets to um, your friends. For example, if you just wanna uh, have a specific bet for them rather than having it in the marketplace. So you'll be able to send custom bets, et cetera. So that's, again, where we'll use the username. So that's a basic look at, oh, sorry, I'll go back here to peer-to-peer, -peer, view the bets. So we wanna take this bet against Jack. You'd come in here, put your odds in and place the bet. Again, that's not fully connected at this stage, but in the next week or two, it will be. Coming back, you'd see your, your, um, your different bets that you'd put on when, if we'd had actually placed a bet, sorry your wallet, and this is where you'd come in and top up your balance, you can deposit, you choose which coin you want to deposit, go in here, Ethereum, connected, you get the, um, the QR code or the address, and then deposit the, the funds that you actually wanted to, to send. Here, again, withdrawal, same sort of thing, very simple, we don't have any balance at the minute, but 
and the swap functionality. So I'll log into a different account that already has some balance and show you the swap functionality. So here you can see we're logged in under a different username. Wanted to show you the, the wallet functionality. This is all built and working. Um, it's tested, it's going really well. So you can come in here, as I said before, and deposit or withdraw. But say we want to swap some Ethereum into BetU. You can see all your transaction history down here. Simply come over to swap. And we want to swap Ethereum for some BetU. O2. Then it, this will automatically calculate the amount of bet you we're going to get. Now this fetches the, the price from the exchange. You don't need to wait for the exchange uh, for it to execute. You can execute it on bet you and then we will execute it on the back end. Um, so here you can come in. We just go swap. So we're trying to swap 0.02 Ethereum into 205 bet you. That swap successful. You can come in here. We can either go back to the swap functionality, the swap page, I should say, or go to the view swap history. And you can come in here and see all the swaps we've done. Uh, then we can go back to our wallet and see our balance, etc. So the next stage is for us to integrate um, the real betting with uh, Bet Radar. We'll pull, as I said, we're already pulling the results, but now we need to finish the bet functionality in the dashboard and stuff. But I just wanted to give a basic overview of where we're at, we're really progressing well and I'm excited with what's being built. For the Bet You Fantasy side, we're gonna use a very similar um, site. However, obviously it's all gonna be all fantasy bets, which I'm really excited about. It's gonna enable us to reach an enormous audience that we really didn't wanna target um, initially. And they're people that um, say don't like gambling or don't want to lose or can't afford to lose. There's an enormous community out there that support crypto projects and we can build a massive army for BetU. So I'm most excited about uh, releasing BetU Fantasy shortly after the, the official BetU platform. So thank you. Have a great day and we'll speak to you soon. Bye.